So far, the Pfizer COVID-19 vaccine is being administered under an emergency use authorization, or EUA. Consider it a kind of temporary green light given by the Food and Drug Administration during a health crisis. We needed a solution to this pandemic immediately. Today, Hamilton County Public Health Commissioner Greg Kesterman was happy to hear Pfizer now wants the FDA to grant its vaccine full approval. All vaccine for the most part is authorized by the FDA with full approval. It's only during these emergency situations that they have to come up with a faster process. But Kesterman and infectious disease expert Carl Fichtenbaum with UC Health say that faster process does not mean Pfizer has rushed the process. The technology for vaccination has been really ongoing in a, a very uh, good way for more than six, seven decades. The understanding of mRNA technology has been known for a couple of decades. To get full approval of its vaccine for people 16 and older, Pfizer has started sharing months of laboratory and human testing data with the FDA. If that information does lead to full approval, businesses could have a decision to make. So obviously, businesses might be able to say, you got to get the vaccine now because it's no longer EUA. Just in general, what are some things that we should be thinking about along those lines? Yeah, I do think that some people will try to utilize uh, the vaccine and say, uh, can we get back to business as usual? I can tell you so far, vaccine mandates have not been the norm because of the emergency use aspect of the shots. Full approval of a COVID vaccine would put it on par with the annual flu shot, which can be a requirement to work in certain industries. Reporting live tonight, Todd Dykes, WLWT News 5. Right, so Todd, any idea how long it's going to be before the FDA decides whether to grant full approval for that, Pfizer's vaccine? Well, Sheree, you're right. That'll be the next big question we're all keeping an eye on. The timeline not exactly clear at this point, but I can tell you in a statement, Pfizer CEO said the company's goal is to win full regulatory approval, quote, in the coming months. Sheree. All right, Todd Dykes reporting live for us tonight. Todd, thanks for the update.